Hey everybody! No mutes! No mutes! How we doing? Welcome to Neo 2. Uh, I've got some coffee here. We are uh, we are playing Neo 2. We're on the fifth map right now. Um, I've kind of I saw some people talking about co-op in chat, and I've kind of gone back and forth with co-op, and I want to have a discussion with you guys about it. I was actually doing some co-op last night, playing uh, some expeditions for the first time, and man, it makes the game really easy. Um, obviously, it's fun playing with people. I'm not against that, but it does bend the challenge quite a bit. So, I can definitely try to get some of you guys in here, and we can do co-op. Or I can do solo, or, what I was thinking, is I could do co-op on submissions and solo on main missions. Sync is off. Here. Let me know if this fixes the sync. Alright. Let me know if that helps. I can also check to make sure the delay settings are right. Why? Go men aside! Alright, let's, uh, let's get this. Seems good? Better? Okay. Cool. Yeah. Sometimes it just does that. It's a very easy fix, fortunately, but, uh... Yeah. Alright, so let's do a quick straw poll. Yeah, sad day for Last of Us 2. I mean, I'm, I'm bummed about it, but I'll have Xenoblade Chronicles. I'm really just mostly sad for Huber, right? Like... Huber loves many, many things, but he really lives for Resident Evil and Last of Us 2, so that, that has to suck for him. Of course he'll be understanding, but poor Huber, dude. I, I, for some reason I've been playing Resident Evil 0. I'm in a Resident Evil mood. We play Resident Evil 0. I don't really have any other commentary beyond that. Alright, how should we handle the stream today? Neo 2 co-op debate. Alright, so you guys are going to vote. All solo. All co-op. Solo, main, co-op, sub. Create poll! Okay, you guys ready? Hope you're having a good day. I'm having a great day. I really have a lot of fun playing Neo 2. It has been so gl slow going because I've been doing everything. And if you do everything, the game is long. But uh, it's been very fun. I like this game a lot. Oh, I guess I could show off my stats and stuff. Um, my controller's not on. So this is me. I am rocking the Nobunaga armor, even though I've encountered better armor. I know I could transmog it, but I just... the Nobunaga armor is so good. Um, been prioritizing heart lately. Before this, I was doing magic. My build is kind of all over the place, to be honest. <laughs> uh, I bumped up my constitution a few points to wear the Nobunaga armor. I have no regrets. But uh, I'm an Odachi main with some magic support, which is nice. The head looks weirdly big on this character. I can see what you're saying. It does kind of look big in comparison to like the slenderness of the body. But it is what it is. Alright, let's see the results. So the main co-op sub, pretty overwhelmingly. Wow. Okay, yeah, 30 to 6 and 1. Alright, cool. We'll do uh I like that. I think that was that's probably the way I'd prefer to do it as well. So let's get people in here. Because we have a main mission and a submission right now. Apparently, I was doing this co-op, and apparently this is the hardest mission in the game. But I was doing a co-op last night, and it was a breeze. So I should redo that at some point solo and see what it's like. Um, okay, so Okuni Search is our mission. We're going to go to the Tori Gate. This is kind of confusing if you've never done it before, so we'll walk through it together. I'm going to go to the Tori Gate. going to go to Expedition. going to go to Custom Match. Create Room. Gonna specify a mission. 
Uh, and then I'm gonna have, oh man, I actually haven't done co-op with two other people. All right, so we're gonna do secret word, and it's Ben Easy A or Benenza if you'd prefer. So two private slots, secret word. Wait, why can't I not create room and wait for visitors? Nani? I wonder if it. I wonder if I have to be appearing online. Hey Ben, how goes it? How you doing? By now, I'm doing well, man. We're about to. Uh... You can see. You can see I'm in a Resident Evil kick right now. Why can I not do this? Oh, I need to select the mission first. Sure, sure. That makes sense. Thank you. All right. That's, I think that's worse than a self-mute right there. I think that's worse. Mark it down. We need a Ben Mute emote. Create room and wait for visitors. Neo is the best Resident Evil game. I don't know how many of you have played Resident Evil Zero. Um, I'm way past this. Well, not way past this. I'm past this by now, but that bat boss is a bullshit boss. I can't think of another Resident Evil boss that is so full of shit as that bat. Oh my god. I wish I could have streamed it because it is hilariously frustrating. Ooh, we got a companion. We got a companion. Paul the Salmon. Look at this... This is like creepy sexy. Uh, switch glaive there. Agility A. Uh, pretty even. Uh, oh, magic. What level are you? Jesus Christ. 212. 212. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I feel like I don't normally complain about bosses, um, but that bat boss is the worst. Okay, I think we have, uh, room for one more, by the way. Hey! Kramel, how you doing? Your character looks really cool. Look at that. That just looks badass. You just look like you're ready to murder. Yo, magic is, magic is strong. Magic is strong. Trust chat to make you come in and make you feel better. The thing is, is like I'm not at the beginning, right? Like I'm level 94, but these these guys, these 200 plus bros. Oh, well, okay, level 123. See that? I'm not as far away from that. But all right, let's do this. When you get people who know what they're doing in co-op, it's like you turn it into a Muso game. Like it becomes a completely different game. You can just <laughs> destroy everything. Glaive build. I haven't messed around with the switch glaive yet. I I will. I will. I've been married to this Odachi, like I'm married to the great sword in Monster Hunter. Right, oh, hey, we, we got a bow to our. Are you joining us too? No, okay. Atlas is asking if people want to rest and release a sort of scramble. What? They uh, they already announced it for us. I mean, I would take it now, if that's the question. <laughs> Yeah, you just, you just, you just unblock everything you go up. It's amazing! It's amazing! And then you throw, like, magic debuffs into the mix, and, like, nothing's gonna have a chance. And then you're all, like, ganging up on stuff with bows. It's great. <laughs> I don't 
I guess, chat, we're all gonna get naked together and... Welcome. Welcome to Easy Atlas. It's a bit loud. Is the game a bit loud? The game is a bit loud. The game is a bit loud. We'll turn it down. Thank you, chat. Uh, I want to fit in a Persona 5 Royal stream at some point, chat. I have not even had a chance to start it, so it would be awesome doing the beginning with you. Everything is just... This level's from Neo 1, right? Yes, it is from Neo 1. Yeah, they definitely reuse things from Neo 1. That was a thing that happened. Will you finish Alex on stream? Uh, not on stream, no. Uh, I might stream it again, maybe? Probably not. Just because I need to focus on getting a review out there. Oh, shit, I went down! That is my fault. I was talking to chat on that one. So, your gauge, you have a gauge, an assistance gauge, when you're playing an expedition mode. Alright, we gotta pay more attention. Being too cavalier. <laughs> it's just so funny. Like, what is? What are they gonna do? Switch gate light also just staggering the shit out of everything. What? Why is there a health bar here? Now it's gone. Okay. Were you surprised at how well the VR stream went? Uh, well, you tell me. Did it go well? Oh, it's Defile. The hot spring is Defile. Uh, Chad, if you want some tips for this game, the snake ability is broken. Use the snake ability. It's very good. Oh, we have a damage immunity buff on right now. That's why some of these hits aren't landing. Yeah, we have a damage immunity buff on it. These guys are bad. But now it should be uncorrupted. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Oh, you are joining us. Hello. <sighs> yeah, I'm really glad. I'm sad we didn't get to do all of the Jeffrey chapter, but... Um, doing that Jeffrey chapter with you guys was amazing. It was so intense, especially on the elevator, having to hold your breath. It was great. Also, you guys got to hear me scream like a little girl when things uh, jump scared me, which was fun. To like go in and around. Uh, we can also, I guess we could just drop. Yeah, he just dropped. All right, let's drop. This is Neo's favorite trick. Is is having ranged enemies at the same. It's his favorite. It's his favorite trick. Just any time you go into a new area, hold down block because something will likely be shooting at you. Alright, I'm gonna drop down here. Get this. Oh! I was teleported. Alright, we triggered an event. That's fine. Oh, we gotta get her. Got you! Uh, 
Um, if you run out of stamina, a trick that you can do is you can just uh, do your burst, and you'll you won't be locked down anymore. Um, it's not always helpful, but it can give you a couple of extra seconds. Of The charge forward move with the Abashi is really, really good. By the way. This snake is so good. I love it. Is everybody okay? Everybody okay? We cool? Let's focus, let's focus on this thing. This is chaos! Alright chat. Are you ready for naked time? I know it's your favorite part. <clears throat> Yo, yeah, why won't Steam let me preload Resident Evil 3? Why won't they let me do it? Why won't they let me do it? Why won't they let me do it? We love some good old naked time with Ben. That sounded both wholesome and vile at the same time. Yeah, I saw Re Resident Evil, or not Resident Evil 7 remake. Final Fantasy 7 remake uh, is out in Europe. Thankfully, no one spoiled it for me yet. No third Soul Core slotted. No. No. I should do that. I should slot a third thing. What do we want? Uh, I actually haven't tried this one. Melee damage versus zero key enemy, plus 5.2 percent. That plus 5.2 is actually kind of nice. The rest of the abilities are whatever. I guess Yokai ability damage plus six is probably the best thing on there. We'll give this a try. Oh, we're at the limit. Uh, we can remove that, and then we could probably add something weaker. Okay, so how much space do we have? A two mic costs six. Okay, so we need something that a two mic costs five or below. These poor co-op people that are with me. I shouldn't spend too much time with this. We'll just slot it and go. Oh, no. What? We must be at 16. So we need something with 4. Dash key consumption. Minus 1%. Sure, we'll take it. There we go. Really optimized build here. Uh, have you found switching cores often or... Chat, don't clip that. Don't clip that, chat. Are you getting FF7 early too? Not as far as I know. I want to. Somebody send me FF7. <laughs> Come on. Oh, sorry, hun. Don't clip that, chat. Didn't happen. Oh, no. You know, it was attuning that third soul core that really tripped me up. Co op. It does make this game easy! Guys, we can't besmirch my pro gamer reputation. We can't besmirch it. Oh, that flame wheel actually seems really good too. 
Uh, it lasts forever. It lasts a really long time. We should consider equipping that. Seems good. Save for the near version up. Yeah, does any- I wonder if anybody has the full number memorized for it. Oh, I'm so excited for the near remaster. Uh, really excited to play the replicant side of it. Because I've only played Gestalt. You know what, they're buffing up, so we're just gonna make ourselves feel cool and buff up as well. They were buffing up because it's a boss. This guy sucks. I've always struggled with this guy. fun though. This game is kind of hard to see. It's not so hard to see um, outside of co-op, but great job Paul and Kremild. Excellent stuff. I also love this emote. Thanks for joining me guys. I assume after this main mission we'll unlock some more uh, submissions to get people in there. Oh, the Yokai Realm stuff? You get so much experience from doing co-op as well. It's crazy. Alright, thank you guys. We are going to do this main mission. Unless we unlocked more submissions. But I don't think we did. No, we didn't. And we have both the Twilight completed. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. I'm actually saving my Omyo skills until we unlock the final tier of the dojo missions. Which we don't have yet, but we're pretty close! 9.5. We're, we're almost there. We're almost there. How are the kids? Uh, the kids are great. 
we spend at least 30% of our day just fawning over the cats. It's probably an underestimation as well. Well, chat, we should do some menu shuffling. We should look at our souls cores a little bit more thoroughly and uh, see what we want more specifically. I don't like the second one that I have equipped anyway, so we'll mess with that. 96, level 96. I'm gonna keep focusing on heart. I need that key. I'm a high stance build. I'd also like to focus on magic more, for more magic damage, but... I think the key is a little bit more pressing. Alright, let's take a look at our gear. Classic Neo style, we have a lot of gear to sort through. It's interesting because... This Blood Splatter Blade will probably outclass the Mirror Blade once it reaches maximum familiarity. And we just have to use it more to get that familiarity up. But it's not there yet. Ooh, look at this. Look at th It might not outclass this. Melee Attack Key Conception, minus 6%. That's amazing. That's an amazing skill. That's amazing. Oh my god, that's so good. Uh, low attack we don't want. We never use low stance. The rest of these are whatever. Break is good, but the rest of these are not that amazing. Uh, but we are going to equip this son of a gun. We can temper those other things out if we want to. And we don't really care about the rest. Oh my god. This is disgusting. All right, what is this? What are the abilities here? Ooh, damage bonus familiarity, C minus. Very, very good as well. Uh, I wish I had an abundance of whetstones. May lower enemy's attack when you successfully hit an enemy with a bullet arrow. That's also very good. It's 17.5% chance to proc. Ooh, and life drain when we bullseye them. This is good. This is the best hand cannon I've ever seen. It's amazing. Okay. We're getting good stuff, chat. We're getting really good stuff. Oh my god. That increase. That increase in defense. Alright, what's the set bonus here? Life... Final blow damage, that's good. Melee damage, this is, these are really good set bonuses. Everything, every tier of the set bonus is good. Uh, which is awesome. So we're equipping that. Not as cool as the Nobunaga armor, but we can transmog it. What are the national unit? Good, not quite as good. Yeah, even though this is more defense, I think I'm going to go for the set bonus here. Sorry, Chad, I know menuing is not the most exciting part, but we'll get there. It is an important part. Uh, I really... At some point, I want to invest in ninjutsu. I might respect to... I, I feel like I've seen builds where ninjutsu is like completely stupidly, aggressively broken <clears throat> with kunai. So we should experiment. <gasps> That's a little sexy. That's a little sexy. Two point five percent unscathed for key recovery is really weird. Okay, um, let us go. Let us visit the blacksmith. Also, blacksmith Chan is 
Wonderful. Best character 2019. <clears throat> I have never used Yokai Incense. I don't know why I would, but I dig it. Tw Did I say 2019? <laughs> Shit, man. It's been a long quarantine. It's been a long quarantine. Bye, Send me Final Fantasy VII and let me die. All right. We I don't think we need to soul match, right? Because it, yeah, we're at one or two. Look at this sexy, sexy beast. So good. Okay. Uh, refashion armor. There's so many options. It's probably at the bottom. Where, wait, where are you? Where's the Conqueror's Gauntlets? What? Can you only trans... Oh, there it is. I just missed it. Classic. Okay. Select piece of equipment we want. We don't show our helmet because our face is awesome. That's why we don't show our helmet. Pro tip. <laughs> if you have an awesome face, don't show your helmet. It is funny, though, when you get to a mimic and they're wearing just, like, some goofy hat on your character. That, that is kind of, it's kind of funny. Look at that. That Nobunaga armor. Choice. Very, very choice. Wait, we did gauntlets already, and we did chests. So we gotta do waste now. I think we already have Conqueror's Boots equipped, so I think we're good there, yeah. Okay, cool. Nice, 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 nice. Um, let's see if we can temper some of these lesser abilities that we don't want. High attack break is good. Twin moons! Okay, so twin moons, I, I, I do this one combo ender all the time. It's called twin moons. And you'll go slice, slice, upward slice, upward slice. And it's so good. 8.9% damage. This game is just asking me to break it. Absolutely we want that. Yes. Oh, that's so nice. Um, block critical we don't really need. High guard key consumption we'll take, though. This is pretty good. This is a, this is a pretty good sword. Alright, so we look cool, we're powerful, um, now the only thing that we need, I should probably be dismantling stuff for mats, because that might be more important at this point, but we're going to make offerings uh, for that experience. I feel like a lot of people don't know that you can do this, but please do this if you're playing Neo 2 and you don't know about this. So if you go to the shrine and you go to make offering, you can offer up all this equipment you don't need. And you will get a shit ton of experience. And it will really, really help you level a lot. A lot, a lot. Um, you also get elixirs, right? So for your storage, you get divine rice where you can get items during missions. That's really, really good. All that stuff. The bunny's the only thing I hate in AC so far. So I was playing late last night, and the bunny was gone. So I haven't seen the bunny yet. I've not seen it. All right, main mission time, solo. Are we ready to do this?
Selection settings on touchpad let you select by levels of rarity and below to make that to symbol and crafting mats even faster. Cool. Do you use the key depletion Omeo talisman? It's great. I don't, actually. Um, I don't... I don't know if I have it unlocked, but I have some skill points where I could. もしや <laughs> I felt myself reflexively bow there a little bit. この<laughs> さよう。this game has the funniest transitions where you'll just be drinking tea and then it's like, oh, no, I'm here, I'm here now. God damn, I look cool, though. I just look so cool. I can't help it. Um, I wouldn't say the story is good. I would not go that far. There are parts of the story that I really like and think are entertaining, and it definitely strikes the right tone, for sure. It doesn't take itself too seriously. Alright, let's check and see if Ooh, shifling. Alright. Imbuing certain active skills with poison seems good. Also imbuing certain active skills with water, depending on the enemy, seems good. This is really good. Extends the duration of your kid ship by 30% while in the dark realm. That's fine too. That's good too. Uh, let's try this. 
shall we? All right, what's this key depletion talisman? Is it on this side? Vitalis drained, blah, blah, blah. Not a far unlock, okay. This robs attack power. Press square to have a list, good call. Weakness. Reduce the defense. Devigorate. Okay. Rob some enemies of attack power. That's not what we want. What's the name of the skill, chat? This... Oh, okay. Is this what you're talking about? Purification? Inflicting uh, additional key damage on yokai? Life seal. Okay. We must have to have, do a prerequisite for life seal. Uh, somebody was saying get barrier. VG was saying get barrier. Yeah, increases key recovery speed. That's really, really good. And dispelling... That is insane. Yeah, that's really, really good. Why can't I find... This life seal! There it is! There it is! Okay, yeah, we need some prerequisites. Okay. So... We need this, and then we need this. We have two skill points. We could get this, or we could get barrier. Or no, we need three points to get it. So let's focus on barrier. Barrier seems absolutely, stupidly broken. Um, and in fact, let's just buff up barrier so we can ready more of them. And then let's change our... No, I don't want to talk to you. Let's change our jutsu setup, shall we? Life seal is good for downing bosses. I might uh, save my uh, skill unlocks for life seal next, because it seems really good. All right. I feel like fire shot and water shot are no longer doing that much for me. Uh, they were pretty good at one point. But let's ready barrier. We're ready. I think, honestly, barrier, steel, and sloth is really probably all you need. Uh, and then. Yeah. Like, that's, that's a pretty powerful array of things right there. And I guess we can put the Raijin feathers, which have not been that worthwhile uh, because I haven't invested. That'd be good. Do you think Ghost of Tsushima will be delayed as well? Yes, I do. I do think it will be delayed. Yeah. Chat, we're all going to have a lot of extra time on our hands, and we're all going to have to platinum Final Fantasy VII Remake. Also, we're going to have a lot more time to play Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. A word to your mama. That was the lamest thing I've ever said. Have you tried the Brave Lady Mountain? No, I haven't. Um, Damiani was talking about it, and he made it... I mean, I was going to play it anyway, but he made it sound so enticing with how it's structured. I can't wait to play it. But I kind of just want to play it all in one sitting. 
and I've I've been very busy with games and Resident Evil Zero. <laughs> I've also been playing Resident Evil Zero. That one's just for me, though. That's that one's just for me. Can we get Jones and Huber on Xenoblade? I don't know. Everybody always asks, like, getting X, Y, or Z allies on something, and it's up to them, man. It's really up to them. Um, let's actually check our skill customization for Twin Moons. Grant certain active damage boosted based on your strength. That's good. Uh, but let's do Murderous Strike. Let's try it out. So this will restore 5% of our health when we kill an enemy with it. We can change it for boss fights, though. Need to review in when, when when the game is done. Uh, no, I don't. I don't want to force anybody to play anything. But I appreciate the offer. Here, let's try to kill him with murder strike. No, nope. not quite close enough. I wasn't seeing the health bar, but all right. How do you like Odachi? I love Odachi. Odachi gets those really, especially in high stance, right? It gets those really big numbers in, which I love and I'm addicted to. Uh, but the other thing is its range. And it's clear that the AI <clears throat> does not always have the Odachi range in mind. And you can kind of... At, there are enemies that will charge you, and you can hit them constantly with the Odachi High Stance before they have a chance to do anything. And it's really fun. Big numbers are lovely. That's right. Happy fun time. Big numbers is definitely my play style. I feel like so it's it's interesting, right? Because a lot of yoke, a lot of bigger yokai <clears throat> don't stagger at all. But humans are so, and I know they're supposed to be fodder enemies, but humans stagger, and so it just makes them incredibly easy because you just hit them and they can't do anything. All right, let's be careful here. Range filth for the win. We did something. <laughs> okay. We'll go over here. Uh, we could try out this. Seems pretty good. Not as good as our snake, though. Snake is OP. You, I, I just do so much stamina damage. It's great. It's great. I think we're going to change this back to strength bonus. What do you think about the AI partners you'll sometimes get? I mean, I'm not a, I'm not opposed to the AI partners being in there. I think it's ultimately a good addition and they can help get aggro off of you. 
but they're pretty worthless. Um, they don't, they don't, they really have no strategy to them. They just kind of run at everything in every situation. So they're not that beneficial. They could definitely be improved somewhat. We aggroed two things. But I'm not, I'm not against them being. Bad situation. Bad scene. We have a shrine right next to us. Alright. So we have our anima built up. Which means we can just do that. And it takes care of a lot of our problems. There we go. Hi. Has anyone told you that your voice is similar to Derek Stephen Prince, who plays Vexen in Kingdom Hearts? No. We, now I want to hear uh, Vexen in Kingdom Hearts. That is not, the voice is not coming to mind. But I'll take it. Uh, Chet, we were saying this during the RE3 stream, but Carlos in Remake sounds exactly like Keanu Reeves, and it's amazing. It's amazing! How do I get over there? How do I get to Cannon Boy? Ben for the next Kingdom Hearts? I would want to be, like, the shittiest character in Kingdom Hearts. It would be amazing. Yeah. be all about it. This game, chat, what's nice about Neo 2, and I was saying, seeing somebody say, like, hey, there's too many games, I was going to pick up Neo 2, but there's too many games, which I totally understand. Um, there are too many games. I haven't even been able to start Persona 5 Royal yet. What the hell is going on? Um... But what's nice about Neo 2 is it's a game that is very accommodating to short bursts. It's very, it's just very playable. Like, you can kind of just do a few missions, stop, and then focus on something else. Uh, the, the mission structure, if you have a lot of games to play, it's very beneficial. Axel is pretty awful. Oh, I like Axel. I like Axel. I'm not against Axel. All right. Sure. Sure. Axel's great, you heathens. You tell him. You tell him. I have no idea what the boss of this mission is. So. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. We're doing okay so far. We're doing okay so far. There's something else I wanted to do. Oh, right. Check equipment. I'm getting so many good weapons. I think we're, we're getting to the end of the game, and so what we're getting for weapons is very, very, very good. Like, strong attack key conception minus 6.2% is what I want on this mirror blade. Very badly. Uh, but you can't... Tr I don't think you can transfer skills from one month to another in Neo 2 anymore, which is too bad. Maybe you can, but I don't think you can. Chat, do we agree that Aqua is best girl? We're all in great unison with that, right? We can all, we can all agree. I love it when these guys join me. So these special NPCs are better than than usually the players that you summon. 
You can, they need the square icon next to it and the filler already maxed. Okay, thank you, that's good information. But I don't think the skill that we want has that icon. Yes, all right, this is the transfer ability. That, that square icon next to it, cool. Which Aqua, Konosuba? The no. I like Aqua and Konosuba, but um, no, I meant Aqua and Kingdom Hearts. I mean, let's let's be real. I know she's the popular one, but Megumi is his best girl in Konosuba. And it's not even close. It's not, it's not close. Stop it. It's not close. I said Megumin. I, I I meant Megumin with an N, but yes. The best Kono Super Waifu is Megumin. It's not, not even good. Sometimes mid stance is really good for hitting multiple enemies, and it's something I should something I should do more often. Okay. Why don't we settle down for a second? This this guy spins to win. That's all he does every time. Is he just spins to win. <laughs> he just does that attack over and over. It's hilarious. It's actually hilarious. It doesn't stop. That guy was taking care of business. This is a waifu. Ian? No, it's Sophie. What are you talking about? It's Sophie. It was just a joke. Come now. Uh, when you switch stanches and you get that cool key pulse, it just it just feels really good. That's all I'm trying to say. It just feels really good. Just feels good. And again. Great. Oh no. I now is not the time. Who says now is not the time to be dead? Why can't I think of that character? Our buffs would help us out. I suck against Wilmings. I am very bad against them. I, I hate them so much in this game. Oh, I think our... No, our, our dude is still alive. Our dude has actually been doing quite a lot of things. That was weird. Sometimes you can just summon your snake and forget about it. <laughs> It's great. Someone made JJ Macfield's dress in AC and looks great. That's awesome. That's really, really awesome. I need some sick outfits in Animal Crossing. It's from Catherine. Right, it is from Catherine. Good call. We should do a Catherine. Have we ever done a Catherine stream? That'd be fun. I don't think we've ever done a Catherine stream. What's wrong with easy allies?
Grand Blue Fantasy Versus. Yeah, we haven't done a stream of that either. I have not played Fantasy Versus in a long time. I've got to get back on that. It's it's a kappa. Tiger skin gauntlets. Key pulse bonus. Increases the initial bonus to key that can be recovered with the key pulse. Oh, cool. Damage bonus familiarity and you can pass it on. That's really, really good. I need to do that. That is really, really good. Familiarity damages bonus are really good. <clears throat> I should lock this so I can't get rid of it. No, that's not, that's the wrong one. It's this one. There we go. <laughs> All right, bud. <laughs> That was a little awkward, but funny. The loot order is white, yellow, blue, purple, I believe. And it just comes to like, down to properties. They have. It's it's like an action RPG in that way. <clears throat> I feel like the set bonuses are so strong in this game, and they really have made me think about what I want. Look at that damage increase. We'll have to. Um, we're not going to break our fashion right now, but we'll, we'll change it later. Is there a green set? Green used to be for things that had set bonuses, but they've changed that in this game. Like, something can be a blue color and still have a green set bonus, as you see with National Unity right there. Green is divine. Okay, so it might be a completely different thing. Um, what's back the other way? Let's go back and explore real quick. Can we use the rusty key on this door now? Yeah, we can. Good stuff. Are orange items in the game yet, or will that be added with DLC? I see they're selling the season pass. Um... Which I need to get. I did not play Neo 1 DLC. I don't want to make the same mistake with Neo 2. I really want to play the Neo 2 DLC if I can. Because apparently the Neo 1 DLC was super cool and I missed it. And you could fight Joe Hayabusa and I missed out and I'm pissed. I want to fight a Hayabusa. <laughs> Ooh, we got two people with us? Yo. Okay. These guys are just asking to be backstabbed. We might get some more use out of mid stance here. I actually kind of want to go back and play the Neo, C Neo 1 DLC. I don't have time now, but... And I don't know when I'll have time, but... You know, it'd be nice. 
Okay. Uh, I guess you guys will rush in there. This is a perfect time to snake! Get rid of this guy. Him like a champion. Alright, anything that we're missing? I don't think so. I love. We didn't even mean to play co op and we're playing co op. Look at that. This guy, all he wants to do is spin. Every time, he just wants to spin. And we have to deny him this Oh, okay. He got mad that I was making fun of him. He got mad. He got mad. It's okay. Um, you know what might be good here is our new buff. Uh, let's see how long this lasts. That means does a lot of damage too. Fully charged. You really get some nice numbers out of it. I feel like I need a better active skill on it, but it's alright. Skeleton is a hammer made in Monster Hunter World, Ben. Can't blame him. Can't blame him. Oh, are you guys leaving? No. We're gonna do this just because we can. Look at that key damage that we did. Disgusting. We got a new Odachi. Let's check it out. That's really good. Sorry, what have you been saying? What? What? Was there anything back at the other end of the cave, or did we... Oh, we missed something. Ooh, a Sunderer. These names are pretty rad. 827! <laughs> oh my god! Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty good. Melee damage plus four is good. Final blow damage, good. Here, we can equip that as the second one. Uh, and we can try it out. See how it scales with familiarity? Also, it just looks amazing. This is a Monster Hunter weapon right here. Dude, hell yeah. Oh my god. Let's unsheath this son of a gun. This is the most awesome edgelordy thing I've ever seen. When in doubt, sneak it out. I love 
catching them with a high stance attack as they backflip the ninjas specifically. It's great. It's great. Turns out P5 still good, yeah. It's very, very good. Playing Tokyo Mirage Sessions while watching. Nice! Chat, if you're bored, seriously give Tokyo Mirage Sessions a chance. It's very good. And it has some very cool Atlas costumes that you can mess around with, if you care about that sort of thing. Stop it. We'll take the trade. There's a dog coming. We got enough experience for a level. We gotta be careful. We have to be careful. Okay. This is where we came from before, I think. Don't forget about running the Willow West. I haven't. No. Uh, my wife and I are gonna play that together. At some point. And I'm very excited. Uh, we played through Ori 1 together and had a wonderful time. But no, have not forgotten. There's just so many games. In a way... And this is kind of a weird thing to say, admittedly. In a way, I'm kind of grateful for delays, because I have so much that I want to play right now. It'd be nice. It'd be nice having some breathing room, I think. Look at those mage lights. This is why you have to explore everywhere. We've got three of them! We had three of them. This, we had two of them this whole time. AC Origins, 72 hours long as I spent in a game. Nice, dude. Nice, nice, nice. I think we can get Life Seal. Oh, this requires two skill points. Oh, no, no, no. It's going to make me do this and then this. Okay. Sure. So we can't quite get Life Seal yet. Um, but we should be using Magic more to get Omeo oh, skill points. That's what we should be doing. Chat. So we should just be kind of liberally buffing ourselves up. Auto use hair locks and settings. Cool. Yeah, I will have to change that. No. Cool. Yeah, I didn't even know that was an option. Good stuff. I think we've explored everything. Uh, did we go up here? No, little Kodama friend! I should have Kodama sensor on, and I don't. Uh, there was also a Kodama, speaking of Kodama chat, there was one over here that I saw but couldn't get to? Yeah, it's like, if you look through there, there's a Kodama and then the evil Kodama. <laughs> How do I get to him? Been binging Fallout 4 without fast travel. That'll keep you busy. Interesting. I've never done like a uh, survival 
mode challenge on Fallout, but that would be a fun stream. I'm actually kind of curious about this Wastelanders update for Fallout 76. I might dip back in for a bit to see how the Wastelanders update is in Fallout 76. Um, okay, so there's a pathway over there that brings us over here. But how do I get to that path? Did a survival mode for New Vegas? Super fun. That would probably be the one I'd want to do it for. That's awesome. It's up above us. I can't... Can't wake up. Okay, we're figuring this out. Ben, use a cannon later on. Is there is there a good cannon opportunity? Oh, look at enemies. New area. Sorry, you're dead now. <laughs> These ninjas, they blend into the background. They're so tricky. They're so tricky. Oh, I see what you were saying about the cannon. I spent like 10 minutes trying to get that Kodama. The cannon later on unlocks it. Okay, thank you, chat. I thought you were just like, yo, there's a sick cannon. <laughs> Blow somebody up with it later. <laughs> That's what I was thinking you were saying. All right, cool. Thank you for saving me the time. I misinterpret chat a lot. Personal flaw. Yo, there's a sick cannon. <laughs> I really thought that's all you were saying. Chat, you make me laugh. You make me laugh. In a, oh, in a good way. Yeah, so you have to use the cannon to blow up that thing. Got it. Yo! Bro, sick cannon up ahead! <laughs> oh. I'm a monk from China. Stop it. Also, high attacks break their uh, horns. You probably knew that, but in case you didn't. No, no. Uh, how's the game audio? Is it too loud, chat? We haven't done an audio check in a hot minute. I think this isolation is starting to get to bed. <laughs> Could be. <laughs> Could be. <laughs> Playing Resident Evil Zero for God's sakes, it's definitely getting to me somehow. <laughs> Wait, my, my bros left me? Don't leave me. All right, not a mimic. So you could tell it's a mimic if it has three of those little things on the side. If it's three of those, it's a mimic. Uh, and there's some cool things you can do with the mimics that hopefully I'll be able to show off at some point. What time is it? We only have a half hour left of the stream. Mimics are nice in this game. Oh, mimics are awesome. 
I wasn't saying, I mean, there wasn't saying they're bad. Just saying how you can identify them. Uh, Weekly Hunt is almost right after. Weekly Hunt is going to be at 2.30. I think once I get heart to 40, I might start leveling magic up more. Uh, we haven't been using magic like we said we would. We need these buffs. We need these uh, skill buffs. There we Look at that! Look it! As soon as I said it, it happens. That was the cannon? Where's the cannon? Life seal! We've got it, chat. We've got it. Touch cannon. Uh, I will be driving weekly hunts. That's really interesting. 20% is a lot of damage. For human bosses. I feel like human bosses are generally easier anyway. Where was the can? Oh, there's the cannon. Haha. -ha. I have you now. So now we got a backtrack. Your guy shift is rubbish in this compared to living weapon. Um, yes, I think you're right. Yokai Shift gets a lot better as you pump skills into it, though, so it's it's practically worthless in the beginning, but it does get much, much, much better. Um, to the point where it can really clutch out fights if you use it well. But it is, it is pretty worthless in the beginning, for sure. not have used that shrine. Shouldn't have done it. Block you fool. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stop it. Stop it. Neo, Neo, you're back on your bullshit. Same.
he dodge through that attack? Is that what happened? That was interesting. Just for fun. Uh, for piloting Wicked Hunts, I just want to know which sexy waifu will be watching. I love that. Uh, we can show off. We can show uh, show off the buff armor of everyone, though. In Monster Hunter, we are all the sexy waifu. Hello, Kodama, friend. Is this even the Kodama that we wanted? I think it is. Is this it? <laughs> oh my god. Is that cannon cannon? Nice warm thing. How about some sake? These, uh, these yokai are alcoholics, I think. Would you rather play FF7 Remake but never have audio, or not play the game but listen to the soundtrack whenever you want? Interesting question. Um, probably play the game but have no audio. I would just put um, the original FF7 soundtrack on in the background, so I think that would be better than not being able to play the game. I would, uh, yeah, I would use the, the original FF7, if I could, I guess. Maybe that's outside of the bounds of the question. But I love your, uh, Kieran armor, but I'm sad unicorns had to die to make it, yeah. I really want Zenogurg layered armor, as I've mentioned. Chat, how would you feel about grinding... <laughs> Raging Brachydios today. Would you be down? Need to work out my build. Do we want to pray yet? I don't think that we want to pray yet. Oh no, we do. We do. Okay. If you give a soul core to a Sudama, it has a chance to drop a rare soul core back. Neat. Neat, neat, neat. Any thoughts on the Resident Evil 3 remake review disparity, like how the scores are all over the place? Uh, no, I think it's interesting. Um, I actually think both the high and the low intakes are very valid. Um, and I think your enjoyment of Resident Evil 3 remake will depend on the type of player that you are. I do think... It's a bummer, right, that, like, unlike RE2, you don't get multiple routes, which I really think added a lot to RE2 and if subsequently the remake. Um, but I get it. I think there are very valid criticisms to levy against Resident Evil 3 Remake, and so I'm glad that those are out there. I can't speak to the full game, as I have not played it. I very much enjoyed the demo, um, and I love Resident Evil, so I'm excited to play it, but... Uh, no, I'm glad. I, I actually think it's more interesting when reviews have a wider spread than when they have a narrower spread. You know what we should do, chat? We should ready our jutsu. So... We probably don't need five sloth. We could probably be okay with three sloth. And we will... Oh. You are expensive. I want two devigorates. And we will... Put you... here, and then we'll put steel down there. I feel like these are some pretty ridiculous talismans that we have. Uh, 
Uh, what up, Aloy Size? How you doing, man? I feel so spoiled this year when it comes to games, and I'm sure not everybody feels this way, right? Like, I know that there are people out there who were not feeling Doom Eternal and, you know, probably don't care about things like Neo or RPG re-releases, but it is definitely hitting many of my sweet spots. Like, I've been enjoying the hell out of Neo 2. I can't wait to play Persona 5 Royal. I, I think Doom Eternal is god tier. I, I'm just very fortunate. I'm gonna get Final Fantasy VII Remake soon. I'm gonna play Resident Evil 3 make, Remake in like a day. That's gonna be blast. I kind of want to stream RE3 Remake, but you guys are gonna be getting so many RE3 streams that I don't want to inundate you. My bow is sick too. Do you guys ever just randomly get an M&M song stuck in your head? It happens to me sometimes. Will I be importing Xenoblade? No, I won't be importing. I'll just wait for us. Hopefully we get it early. Not a cost I need to incur at this time. Duke Nukem Steam's been stuck in your head. It's a good theme. It's a good theme. I don't I don't blame you. Ninja locks. Oh, I think he, she meant the collector set, which is much better in Europe. I just, I misinterpreted the question again. Um, I actually have not looked at the European collector's edition for Xenoblade, and that's probably been to my benefit. Could somebody link it in chat? This is, this is going to go poorly. <laughs> Fuck. Could somebody link the collector's edition in chat? I actually have not seen it yet. Stugger. Our boy! We gotta kill our boy! どうだ。<笑> Guys, my character is so good. You've been corrupted. Hopefully we have enough time for buffs and debuffs. We may not. Okay, that was a bad opening. We want to we want to get key damage in. He's fast. He's fast. He's fast. We gotta be careful. He's very fast. Trade. 
Oh, he's got buffs on himself, but he's limiting damage that can do. This should help. Guys. I love that the de devs are trolling you and they're like, alright, you use your OP buffs. We can do that too. What? 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 What was that? We have to do that attack a little sooner, and I think we'll get it. The music's fantastic, by the way. I actually don't like it when he has the dual blades out. It's worse. Might be a good time to Yokai shift soon. No, oh, no! He just comboed us to death there. Okay, I think we got that fight. It's not bad. It might. I feel like he's recovering stamina pretty quickly, so we might not focus on um, the life drain as much. Not the life drain, the key, the life seal ability. Um, we'll still have it shortcut, but I think we'll change it. To here. And then set that up. Steel is really, really good. Um, we actually might get more use out of sloth as well. We might change this up if this doesn't work to have more sloth. I might have buffed too early. That's right. Okay. Definitely gotta be careful. There are times where I feel like I could normally get an attack in, but his dual sword stance is pretty fast. Um, and I'm misreading it a lot. Alright, we can get him out of stamina here. If we... Oh, we missed a, an attack opportunity. There we go. Grapple damage. Good. Right, this is going much better. He's just blocking? I feel like he, the RNG is being nicer to us. Oh, we had... Come on. Nope, we missed it. Okay, we'll get our key back. Um, let's go ahead and yoke that shit. You know, that was a pretty easy fight. Pretty easy fight. And I feel like we avoided some of this nonsense, which is good. First try, yeah. Second try is not bad, though. <laughs> Man, I really like this guy, too. Power corrupts, absolutely.
the Big Bad. I actually don't really know what the deal is with this guy, other than he is puppet mastering things. Uh, question from the chat. Did you get the Xenoblade links from chat? I did. Also, you're still watching Clone Wars. I am not. I've been really bad about watching shows recently. The only show that I'm actively watching is Westworld, and that's just because I can do it week to week. Uh, pretty much all my free time has been games. Um, it has been a very busy time just with like trying to do EZX and trying to get reviews out and coverage and we're doing a lot of streaming, and so I've I've just been bad with shows. But I do want to get back to it at some point. If I can. Ooh, sold out. So is it sold out everywhere, chat? Let's take a look at these images. Yeah, I need that. I just need that. That's a thing that I need in my life. <laughs> All right chat pre-order now Ooh, I can do it from game 57 days left to pre-order nice 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 okay I've never ordered from game before are they good oh no 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 this item cannot be internationally shipped look at that look at that at the bottom of that game link cannot be internationally shipped I am doomed Keep an eye on here. Don't think this one's been posted yet. Please know this is the NTSC version of the game, which is compatible with all Nintendo Switch systems. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay. So I can I can just I should know the answer to this, but I don't. I can just play a European copy on my American Switch, right? It says currently unavailable, but may be available. Okay. Um, I will try to keep an eye out. Chat, if you see any pre-orders that ship internationally for Xenoblade collector's editions go up, let me know if you could. That would be really cool. Obviously, you don't have to, but uh, I would appreciate it very much. Okay. Let's do... You know what? We don't have a lot of time left, so I was going to do a gear check and stuff, but that'll take a while. I think we can fit in one more co-op mission. We have a submission here that we can do. If you guys are in. Nice. All right, chat. We're opening up. Are you okay with game breaking new game plus builds joining you? Totally. Totally, totally, totally. When we're doing the co-op, it's just for fun, so. There's always forwarding services if the site accepts US cards billing addresses. It's an extra charge on top of that. Never used a forwarding service, but might be worth looking into. Gerzilla, nice. I like your character. I love that eye patch. Rocking it. Rocking it. Ooh. Oh! Hey, Vaughn. I like the, uh, the white in the hair, too. It's very, very nice. All right.
Thank you, Ben. I also love the eye patch. Eye patch always good. I need to. Well, I was rocking the eye patch in Monster Hunter for a while, but yeah, eye patch always good. Just use one for European SNES Nintendo Switch Online controllers. Nice. I wish. It's so easy to make me spend money. It's it's a sickness. It's a sickness. Look at, look at how beautiful everything is, including our lovely friends. All right. What the hell was that? Do that again. What? How do I do that? I want to scream too. That was great. Interesting that um, expeditions have a separate experience pool than when you're on your own. Why, hello. I'm glad we avoided that attack. The Kabuki Dance. I think I actually have that. I might have to customize my emo palette, but I think I have it. Maybe not. Buffs. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, those ki those kunai builds, man. They're so good. But did you go back and play the other routes in Three Houses? I saw someone suggest a Blue Lion stream with Jones. Um, maybe at some point. I would love to do that in person. I've I've done... Uh, Black Eagles did that for the review, and then I've done a chunk of Yellow Deer. Haven't done any Blue Lions, um, which would be fun. And then I did the DLC. I did Cindered Shadows as well. Loves these arenas. Golden Deer did not disrespect us. That wasn't disrespect. What? Yellow Deer? It was just a mistake. Come on now. Come now. No need for such sensitivity. Brad can vouch for blue lines. I mean, everyone can vouch for blue lines, right? I know they're good. It's not that they're not good. I know they're good. I get it.
Uh, whatever route you choose, how can you go back and do another? Doesn't it just hurt? Yeah, I... And it's actually something that's been kind of annoying. The, the Three Houses discussion, some people take it way too far. And that's actually my viewpoint. It's not that I don't enjoy the other routes, but I also think there's a lot of satisfaction in connecting with whatever route you chose and feeling some loyalty to that. It's kind of like character loyalty in fighting games, right? And so some people get upset that I haven't done every route in Three Houses, but it's like, I really enjoyed Black Eagles, and that feels like my crew. Like, it... I don't know. I... I really have no regrets with what has happened. That's... That Black Eagles is my house, man. The, the reason it's hard because I feel a connection with Black Eagles, like I feel torn. I feel both sides of the argument pretty strongly. I just want to play more Fire Emblem, really. So that would be like doing the other routes as an excuse to do that because I enjoy the gameplay of Fire Emblem so much and I want more of that. But I also feel a loyalty to my house. So I feel both things equally. Avalgar is so against everything, so I didn't do her route. The thing is, is like, you get her side of the story if you do Edelgard's route. So it'll probably give you a different perspective. I see where you're coming from. Because she does come off as a monster in the other routes. But uh, it will give you a new perspective, for sure. That's kind of the whole point of it. My favorite house is helping I don't think we've done a three... I, has Dom, I guess Damiani's done a Cindered Shadow stream, but I don't think I've done a Three Houses stream. That might be fun, if you guys want to play some Fire Emblem. I'm always down for more fucking Fire Emblem. I, I really just want a new Fire Emblem every year. That series is so good, and I love it so, so fucking much. Cinder... I, like... I get it. I know not everybody likes Cinder Shadows. I loved Cinder Shadows. It was pretty much everything I wanted out of a DLC. The map design was so much better than it was in the main game. It was so good. I don't remember what chat it was, but people were hyping up Fire Emblem 4. I would really love a remake of that. Have you listened to Shinsuke Nakamura's entrance theme? Um, Huber and I, a long time ago, like years ago, were watching some Shinsuke Nakamura, so not if it's new. And, like, I can't remember it anyway, but, yeah. The map design in the later stages of Three Guys has improved quite a bit. Um, yes and no. It depends on how later you're talking. The last few missions were pretty good, especially the last mission. I liked it a lot. Um, but I, it could have been better. It could have been better. And I think the DLC shows pretty strongly that it could have been better. I think the battles in the DLC are just, by and large, much more interesting. Alright, oh, look at this mask. I'm finna to play some Tekken over here. played the Tear Ring Saga games. No, I haven't. 
poor Grizzilla is just fighting by himself. Sorry, dude. How do we get over to him? Does this wrap around? This might wrap around. I have lost all sense of place. Help me, Vaughn. All right, there we go. He unlocked the door. Nice. Grizzilla was soloing that there. Yo, I don't know if you guys... I'm sure a lot of people have, but look at these... Look at these cats. Best character 2018. I wonder if they'll announce like a Fire Emblem remake at the end of this year or something. I really wish there was more DLC for three houses. That would be hype. Please, intelligent systems. Okay. In this war zone. Tackle. I actually haven't seen that animation yet. That's really cool! That is really, really cool. Sweet. Thanks, Grizzilla. Thanks, Vaughn. Fun stuff, you guys. Oh, look at all the gifted subs. Thanks, Kane Alex, for all the gifted subs, dude. Much appreciated. Ben, are you guys streaming Final Fantasy VII Remake on Thursday nights? Uh, not that I know of. You mean next Thursday? Not tonight. Next Thursday. Um, we will be doing something. We'll be doing for Final something for Final Fantasy VII Remake. I know... You really want us to, and I totally understand. But we will we will do something. Uh, so look forward to the schedule next week, for sure. If you like Fire Emblem and you like 2D oldies, treat yourself to a Shining Force 2 session. Yes, I do want to treat myself to Shining Force 2 at some point. I want to treat myself with that Panzer Dragoon remake. That's what I want to do. Good stuff. This is a fun stream. Streaming Neo is always a blast. I always have a good time. Um, I think the mix between co-op and solo worked really well. That was awesome. Um, I have seen the Mario rumors, yes. And they're like, we heard you about Paper Mario and we swear we'll make it good this time. Which is really exciting. For sure. Alright, thanks guys. Uh, sorry I got a little, I, I, I didn't think I was that heated, but I got a little testy with the Fire Emblem stuff. I feel like Fire Emblem houses and characters and loyalties and play styles, it's hard not to be passionate about Fire Emblem, but if that was annoying, I apologize. I just like talking about Fire Emblem. Anyway, um, we will be back in a short amount of time. Around 2.30 for weekly hunts. See you then. Bye, guys.